Well, Julie, it is the responsibility of members of the House Republican Conference to choose their leaders. Uh, and I'm confident that in previous situations, we've seen members of the conference actually make the case that who they choose to serve in their leadership says a lot about who they are, uh, what their values are, and what the priorities of the conference should be. Now, we've also heard a lot from Republicans, particularly over the last few years, including the chairman of the Republican Party, about how Republicans need to broaden their appeal to young people and to women, to gays and to minorities, that the success of their party will depend on their ability to broaden that outreach. So it ultimately will be up to individual Republicans in Congress to decide whether or not elevating Mr. Scalise into leadership uh, will effectively reinforce that strategy. There's no arguing that who Republicans decide to elevate into a leadership position says a lot about who, what the conference's priorities uh, and values are. And, I mean, ultimately, Mr. Scalise reportedly described himself as David Duke without the baggage. Uh, so it'll be up to Republicans to decide what that says about their conference.